And then what'd you do? Huh? And then what'd you do? Suck the world of fire! Fire! We made Channel Kiss the revolution was a lie! That's Jorge. You guys will see him in a second. It's Thursday, and um, I got nothing planned. We're gonna go get some breakfast, so that's about it. We've been playing video games all day. Uh oh, uh oh. Vega. <gasps> yeah, it's about time we start doing another vlog. So we're gonna show Jorge a little bit of um, I'm gonna take Jorge out and show him a little bit of um, Vegas. Some fun Vegas. Uh, that's about it, we're just gonna start a new vlog. Get going. So like the first time I met Jorge was like a long time ago, like maybe 10 years ago, over in Kansas City when I used to live out there. I moved out there from Sacramento to work over at the Power and Light and uh, he was one of the first guys I met, so. This is Jorge. That's right. Oh, that's right. I was brushing my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, uh, I forgot to tell you guys that Jorge is an actor. Which, uh, Jorge, mm -hmm. explain to them what, what you do. Like, hold on, I have to spit the drink. Wait, anyways, he's got like shows on Netflix. Uh, he's been on movies before. He did voiceovers. He's been on like billboards and stuff like that. He thinks this is a really big deal. I don't think he's that big of a deal, but anyways, what do you do? No, I'm not, I'm, I, I, I'm just kind of a big deal, just. Uh, but I'm a voiceover actor, uh, I'm an actor. I've done theater, I love theater. Unfortunately, with my job right now, I don't have the time to rehearse. What movies were you in? The movie was uh, Fight Night. What uh, was your line? <laughs> Last time I beat up a woman was in my honeymoon. <laughs> <laughs> this is, this is his, his line right here. La dernière fois que j'ai frappé une meuf, c'était à ma lune de miel. Monsieur Carlos Mendoza. Un kilo, mademoiselle. Damn it, don't you. Way to go, Jorge, yeah. <laughs> Woo! Acting yeah. chops, 100. I have one coming up too uh, this year. Uh, All Creatures Here Below, a film by Dave Uh He was in Dark Knight, uh, Gotham, Ant-Man. Uh, pretty cool. He's from Kansas City. And a lot of Kansas City talent in that movie. All Creatures Here Down Below. Yeah, so go check that out. I don't know if I'll have a link for it, but if I do, it will be right here. Not so. yet. It's still on there. It should be out about the end of the right, Am I able to like put this out? Like if I put this out tomorrow, would... You get in trouble? No, of... no, no, because I'm, all I'm doing is uh, promoting the film. The film already went out at a downtown LA film festival, so... Oh, it's already, already been out, so cool. It just should be out in theaters soon. By the way, we gotta talk. I can't talk about this right here in front of you guys, so we'll pick it up later. There's Ray. Let's do it. Let's do it. To go explore some Vegas! El Vamanos! So they're like literally maybe 35-45% done with the Raider Stadium. This is what it looks like right now. You can start seeing like where they're gonna have the giant window. It's gonna take 10 minutes to open up and close. And that is the monthly Raiders update. <laughs> We made it. We just got to find out where Zach's at. It's a good ride, buddy. All right, we're at pole position. This is a little indoor go-kart race place that you can go to in Vegas. It's on Arville and Flamingo. So if you're heading towards from uh, like Vegas trip, you come this way and then you take a right right next to the Palms. So you'll see right here. That's the Palms building right there, right next is <laughs> is the pole position. Uh, 
Hey there, it's Voice Over Billy again to tell you a little bit about our experience at Pole Position. As you see here, we're at the registration area, the spot where you give all your personal information away. Really exciting stuff. Once you complete the registration, you got a couple of choices for arcade games to play to pass the time until you get scheduled for your race. As you see here on this side, they have a target car, a go-kart, here's the racetrack, and one more race car. Two is 60, three is 75. Each race is 12 laps around the track. Thanks, man. No problem. Now as you see here, they cater to the non-shoe wearing crowd like yours truly. And they loan me a pair of stinky tennis shoes along with some not too big angle socks. Anyways, enough of me jawing away. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. Fatality. Let's go race. That one was good. Uh, we're gonna find out who was the fastest lap on that one. So we're done with race number two. Uh, probably just gonna do one big compilation of all game, but uh, pole position is pretty fun. We're gonna go see the results right now and crown the one first place victorious. It's definitely not Jorge. Yeah, because you're the one that always goes first. What, what does that matter though? It, it matters a lot. That means all of us are great freaking drivers and because the you're the one that goes first, the we never end up passing each other because <laughs> we use every single second to our advantage. This guy is the making... way might be it. So it's a tie. Who, who got it? Was it Tim? It was a tie. Was it Jorge? It was a tie. Or was oh, it me? Last one, it was me. Yeah? It was me. Because I, I dusted your ass. <laughs> Only because I was trying to get B-roll footage of cool ass shit. First rounds of races, I was first. I was second. I was third. All right, so let's find the next race. By less than a second. That has to be on record. We're gonna go by fastest time ever. So the next one will be uh, the true test to see how we average out. Yeah, it does help. Yeah, it does help. <laughs> All right, here we go. So since this is like a, a big, huge controversy on like who got the best score, we're gonna do the ultimate average. The slimmest of margins. We're done with pole position. Tim is victorious with first place. There he is, taking his victory lap. Yo, Tim, congratulations. I won this pen. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. Let's get out of here. One more competition, let's do basketball real quick. No, oh, come on, let's go. Oh. I'm hungry. Now let's walk it around. Pull my soul way down in the dirt. We're done with uh, pole position. We're gonna go do uh, time lapse real quick, and that's gonna probably be it for the vlog. Time lap? Yeah, time lapse of the stadium, so we can show our viewers. Oh, oh, oh! I see what you said. We can show the viewers how the stadium is coming along. Stopping over here. We're gonna do a couple quick time lapses for you guys, so you can see what the stadium looks like with time lapse. Thank mm -hmm. you. 